Hi, my name's Karen Potter and I'm the Warden and Projects Manager, manager here at the Gaze and Salts Nature Reserve in Sandwich. Uh, we find ourselves in a situation, as many charities do at the moment, where we're running very short of funds and we'll only be able to keep the charity going for another two years unless we can find some new income sources. And we do hope that you might be able to help us. This is a wonderful reserve. It's enjoyed by 10,000 people a year. We've got a whole host of wildlife here, including endangered water voles. We've recorded over 160 species of birds. Um, it's a man-made reserve. We've been putting as many habitats back as possible in a small area. We have woodland, wetland, um, reed bed, scrub areas. It's an absolute delight and it would be so, so, so sad that if we lost it. Seems like we're in the heart of the countryside here, but really we're just less than a mile from Sandwich Town Centre, aren't we? Yes, I mean it's an absolutely beautiful illusion. We're less than uh, five minutes from a car park, five or ten minutes from the centre of Sandwich. We're situated right on the edge of Sandwich, just off the A257, and it's so so easy to get to. Um, you can come in by bus, and you're only about a five-minute walk away, ten or fifteen-minute walk away. Um, from the train station. It really is lovely. We're so close to the local schools. Some of the parents bring the children from the infant school, which is only five minutes away, and they'll bring them on a daily basis in the summer to come and feed the ducks. It, it really is a fabulous resource. So it's a real, on the edge of town, it's a way for children to really see the countryside without having to go too far, isn't it? It is, yes. It, it is really ideal. And we've made a point of putting plenty of seats in so that uh, small legs and uh, tired legs can sit down. And it is, uh, we've got a mile and a half of footpaths and everybody likes to feel they've got the place to themselves. And we've designed them in such a way that uh, you can't see footpath, the other footpaths that are close by. So you feel as though you've got it to yourself, although you might be sharing it with with the hundred other people on a busy Sunday afternoon. We're standing by the Round Pond, which is our only fresh water pond. All of the other waterways are fed by the River Stour, and so they're brackish. Um, this is a wonderful uh, little pond, as it has frogs and newts and so on in it. But other areas of our work that people aren't aware of are things like uh, we have lots of people for work experience placements, and this is something which is so important that it helps people gain new skills um, to take them into the workplace. We also run training courses in conjunction with other charities uh, for young people who are finding it difficult to get into work or have been unemployed for a long time and, and that can last for up to three months and uh, there was volunteering opportunities too where people can build confidence and learn new skills and benefiting the environment at the same time. This reserve has so many things to offer to so many people as well as just the wildlife that we really, really, really would like your help to, to try and save it. Thank you very much and best of luck.